big uh, welcome to every one of you to today's game. I'm Martin Tyler, and the biggest welcome from me is to Alan Smith alongside me. Paris Saint-Germain today involved in our match, and they play Real Madrid. Well, the investment, the money from Qatar into Paris Saint-Germain, Alan, has made a huge difference. Well, it's almost like a different football club now, isn't it, with that money behind them, the ability to attract top, top players. Here's a couple of players who you might keep a special eye out for today. Alan Smith's certainly going to do that. Well, two excellent attacking players we are treated to seeing. They're really enjoying good seasons, and I'm expecting a bit more of the same today. Paris Saint-Germain, this is their lineup. In goal, Kevin Trapp. Thiago Silva plays with Marquinhos in central defence. Marco Verratti plays with Thiago Motta in central midfield. Edinson Cavani is the main striker today. This is the Real Madrid lineup. Keylor Navas in goal. Sergio Ramos plays with Rafael Varane in central defence. Tony Kroos starts with Luka Modric in the centre of the park. Karim Benzema is the lone striker today. First half started by Real Madrid. Tony Kroos. Karim Benzema. Well, they're in a good position here. Marcelo. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's got support here. Marcelo. Defending strongly there and making sure that Cross didn't get into the danger area. Tony Cross. And here they are on the attack. And he's got the ball away from him with the tackle. Live at Kusawa. Really get at the opposition here. He's got his shot off now. And the ball's gone out for a corner. Decided that this time they're going to play the short corner. Well, that's the keeper's ball from the moment the cross left his foot. Karim Benzema. Tony Kroos, able to make a good interception. Edinson Cavani. Modric. Well, this attack, Benzema, good vision here. The return ball. Angel Di Maria. Here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Modric. Here's Casemiro trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Shot off! Offside. The officials clearly in agreement. And that's a straightforward offside decision. Thiago Mota. Edinson Cavani. Baratti. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. Marcelo. Karim Benzema. Modric. A strong play by Paris Saint-Germain to win the ball back. Thiago Mota. Julian Draxler. 
Cavani. How about that for a goal? It's given them the breakthrough. And they've had to work very hard to find a way through this defence. But when it came, it was superbly taken. And they're absolutely thrilled with the way they've got the lead here. Well, he gambled to get into there. So close to goal, and the ball just fell for him. Yeah, that's meat and drink for any good striker. Just another one on the tally. Oh, look at the manager. He works hard on his team on the training ground, and he's seen some reward for it down there now. Paris Saint-Germain in front. Sergio Ramos. Tony Kroos. Here's Casemiro. Trying to stretch the opposition using the wider areas here. Mail. Back to Modric. It was good play until they got that challenge in. Benzema. Tony Kroos. Ronaldo. And the referee blows his whistle. The flag was up for offside. Baratti. Di Maria. I think the cross is on. Cross by Di Maria. It's in! Fine moment for them. They've got a firmer grip on the game now. They're two ahead. A goal there to really savour for all of us watching. Well, it's come in from a long way out, and from that angle, it's not always easy to finish. Defenders caught out by it in the end. Oh, it's a brilliant header. Just widen the margin here to 2 0. Sergio Ramos. Now, this looks promising. the move and able to cut out the pass good play but they've lost the ball now and the opposition can get at them oh, reached by the goalkeeper to tip it over the bar no doubt that's a corner in goes the corner only partially away from danger. And shoots! Great save by a diving goalkeeper. Well, that's half-time. And 2-0 is the score at the halfway mark. We're at the start of the second half. And it's Paris Saint-Germain who hold the advantage at this point. Sergio Ramos. Now Casimiro. Nice bit of interplay between these two. This could be a chance. Stopped emphatically and just as well. Ronaldo. Well, they're not out of reach yet, are they? If he'd taken this chance, they would have been right back in the game. Yeah, it wasn't a glaring miss, was it? It was a decent effort, not far away. How many more chances might they create in this game, though? Now Danny Alves. Julian Draxler. This is excellent from Paris Saint-Germain. Thiago Mota. Verratti. Neymar. Crossed in towards Di Maria. Could be dangerous. Modric. Benzema breaking away. And Benzema finished with great aplomb there. It's a fine goal from a fine centre forward. It was a good chance, but against this goalkeeper, you sometimes wonder whether they're ever going to score. They have done now. Yeah, you can't be expected to, to keep on stopping them if you keep on offering up chances. Off we go again, 
Kozawa. Baratti. It's looking good, this move. And Drax Draxler. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Modric. Here's Casemiro. Karim Benzema. Attacking now. Julian Draxler. Edinson Cavani. Lovely pass from Cavani. The shot's on. Oh, what a fine goal. They lead by two now. They'll feel a little bit more comfortable. And they're good value for this advantage at the moment. He looked the goalkeeper in the eyes and said, right, I've got the win here, and he's got the goal to show that. Oh, I love that kind of finish when you don't have to blast it as long as the placement is right. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scoreline. Tony Kroos. Cristiano Ronaldo. Into the attacking third. Gareth Bale came in with the challenge and the ball broke free. Edinson Cavani. That's clever with a through pass from Verratti. Di Maria with the run. No way through, says Navas with a sub. He's got his shot off now. Di Maria! They scored! It was slow and steady and it won the race. What a wonderful volley. It's a wonderful ability to have, isn't it, to connect so sweetly. It's all about timing, that volley. And we can see a slightly different viewpoint on it. I don't think we expected this. Such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here. And shoots! So they're setting up for the court. It's Real who want to make an alteration now. They're going to bring on a substitute. Cross with the corner. A decent fist away by the keeper. And in he goes with the tackle. Won it back well with that tackle. Now they can attack. Shot on! And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. Cavani showing good vision here. And in on goal, Di Maria. Neymar. He's in here. How did he save that? Uh, he's one of the best in the business for those kind of situations. Absolutely brilliant. A substitution for Real Madrid. They've gone short with the corner in towards the near post. But he's got his fist to it. Di Maria with Pastore. Angel Di Maria. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. This turnover could be costly. Crafting the through pass. It's beautifully tied, the run from Ronaldo. Well, it's always a pleasure to score a goal, but in these circumstances, it's probably the minimum amount of pleasure that you get. It's a goal. It's something to take with them as the final whistle goes in a few moments that they have scored right on the end of the game here, right on the final whistle, but not much more than that. No, Martin, a bad day at the office all round and uh, plenty of work for the manager to do on that training ground. And the referee has now called a halt. I hope you've enjoyed the game as much as we have up on the commentary gantry and the winning team will be enjoying it because a win's one thing, but to win playing that well, certainly in the attacking sense, 
That's almost the whole package, isn't it? It is. I mean, they, they swarm forward and uh, the opposition didn't know where to look. Uh, the movement, the work, right, and then the finishing, you couldn't fault it.